In the Cyper project initiated by the Presidency of Defense Industries, a high-speed target aircraft was successfully shot down within the scope of the Integrated System Level Shooting Test President of the Presidency of Defense Industry Professor Dr. Ismail Demir announced the development on his social media accounts with the following statements. A success worthy of the glory of our ancestors on the anniversary of the Great Offensive and Manzikert from our defense industry. Our long-range air defense missile system, Cyper, is rising step by step. In the last test shot of Cyper, it showed that it can reach 100 kilometers at high-speed targets. Cyper completed another stage with this hit success. I congratulate everyone who has passed the test. In the video of the test, elements of the Cyper battery such as the TIRS radar and the fire control center took place. Jet Banshee 80 type high-speed target aircraft was used as the target in the test. Banshee high-speed target aircraft, it was also used in the tests of other air defense systems developed by Turkey, such as Hisar and Korkut. According to the information in the 2022 Institutional Financial Status and Expectations Report published by the Ministry of National Defense, the first system is planned to enter the inventory in December 2022 within the scope of the Long Range Region Air and Missile Defense System Project Phase C Cyper Project. The development and testing activities of the components of the Cyper Long Range Air Defense System, which will operate at long range high altitude within the scope of layered air defense that Turkey is building, continue. In this context, the first test firing of Cyper Block Zero, the first of the missiles to be developed of the blocked type, was carried out in November 2021. In order to meet the high altitude air defense needs of the Air Force's command, it will ensure the survival of friendly troops by limiting, delaying or neutralizing, destroying, the enemy's air breathing target, cruise missile and air-to-ground ammunition attacks in war, which will provide an effective deterrent in peace and crisis. Between the Presidency of Defense Industries and the Aselsan Roketsan Tubitak Sage Business Partnership with the aim of developing a system that will provide strategic and economic facilities against air-breathing targets, cruise missiles and air-to-ground munitions attacks, and that will enable the execution of joint operations in more favorable conditions. January 15, 2018 The Long Range Regional Air and Missile Defense System Project Phase C Cyper Long Range Region Air and Missile Defense System provides long-range air defense of strategic facilities against enemy attacks, and has distributed architecture, close and distant deployment capabilities, multiple engagement and sequential firing, ability to work in harsh weather conditions, land, air, sea and rail. It is capable of transporting, multi-tactical data link and upper command control integration, connection with radar network management system, RADNET, and Air Force Information System.